We are grateful for your ongoing support of the CoinSuries channel. At least for the time being, XRP is trading at less than 54 cents. Maybe it will soon break over this level, which was support not long ago, but is currently functioning as resistance. The level remained relatively constant over the majority of the previous seven days. But XRP isn't the only cryptocurrency that can do this. The market is falling generally, however individual industries are showing signs of improvement. Still, the sky is looking really scarlet as a whole. The sales have not been too impressive, in my view. But Bitcoin is currently the undisputed leader in this industry. It doesn't matter to me, what matters is that many things have recently seen significant increases. Quite remarkable, I must admit. I get that XRP has a lot of skepticism, but I also have coins that were part of just as unfriendly communities and made it big. It happened despite first doubts. If you don't anticipate a market meltdown, you should anticipate that XRP will track the market. After that, everything else can stay put if that's really the case. Still, I don't see that happening very often. Take VeChain as an example, since I initially purchased it a few months ago, its price has increased by almost 100%. HBAR, on the other hand, has increased by a factor of 2.5 or more in the past several months. Compared to the 19th of October, the flare-up is five times worse now. Someone yelling that these three coins are dead and won't move made me hold back three of them that were totally okay to begin with. Ripple is also not very helpful. Still, I anticipate a significant price increase for XRP as a result of this. Whenever I am able to participate in a price discovery, I maintain my faith in the new XRP. Unfortunately, we aren't given the option to select the precise time that it takes place. Allow me a brief time to apprise you of the current state of the markets. I should preface this by saying that I have zero experience or training as a financial advisor. Do you agree with me that what I say cannot possibly be used as a foundation for a purchase or sale? Making and posting movies to YouTube about cryptocurrency is something I enjoy doing in my spare time. I am merely an admirer. On top of that, for the sake of it all, Coincidentally, my mental cryptocurrency was just demonetized. Another sign of how bad things are would be if everyone started complaining about tokenomics. Everyone should hold on to this one, because the tokenomics of coins 3 and 4, XRP included, are terrible. Has the word tokenomics ever occurred to you? Some folks just don't seem to understand, and I don't know why. But people throw around that word a lot. The point is not that tokenomics are irrelevant, that has been made before. Contrarily, demand is more crucial, and strong demand indicates that money may enter at a quicker rate during optimistic market conditions. Alternatively, Filecoin's value has increased by more than 100% in the past three months, along with a number of others. Contrary to popular assumption, not all of these coins have been destroyed. You receive a 72 out of 100 for crypto-related anxiety and greed. Giving way to overwhelming greed is the result. Being greedy is all we're doing right now. Also, I had to share this post from Zero Hedge since it was fascinating and, dare I say it, scary. Since, I assume, we're all aware at this point that, you know, Bitcoin is generally considered riskier than equities. That being said, it's not surprising that when one asset class experiences huge price movements, other asset classes frequently follow suit. Therefore, a fall in the value of Bitcoin would be consistent with a fall in the value of the stock market. As a result, this is somewhat concerning, but they did communicate through avoiding risk, S&P 500 increases 2% There have only been three Thursdays in the past 60 years, when fewer than 60% of NYSE shares climb right up until 2020. From your perspective, it seems like things are only going to grow worse from this point on. Very bad, oh no. Nothing had ever been like that. Oh, behold that. There it is. Another one of those years is just not possible, is it? Problem number 87, the global epidemic of 2010 to 2011. I guess waiting for something to happen is our only option. But what happens next is completely unpredictable. 
Whatever the case may be, most market watchers predict that stock and cryptocurrency prices will continue to rise in 2024. The Coin Telegraph's Rakesh Gupta also thinks this way. Chart analysis is part of his job description. Bitcoin is more likely to experience a short-term decline if it encounters strong resistance near $52,000. The spot Bitcoin exchange traded funds had a net outflow of approximately $36 million on February 21st because to the sideways activity, according to many sources, one of which is a BitMEX research. The ETFs, however, received more than $251 million once the bleeding stopped on February 22. While forecasting a market decline before the April halving, prominent trader and analyst Rekt Capital compared the current Bitcoin bull run to the bull runs of 2016 and 2020. There may have been a retrace and reaccumulation time before and after having children, according to historical evidence. Although Bitcoin has been reluctant to maintain its rise, other rival cryptocurrencies have begun to see rewards. As a result of the weekend air clearing and the opportunity for stronger hands to add at lower levels, the markets ultimately gain from corrective phases. To me, that's an extra crucial consideration. Buyers' feelings tend to get cold or terrified when prices decline, for reasons that should be readily apparent. The sell the news occurrence involving the Bitcoin ETF is the only significant downturn that has occurred recently. What is it compared to? A range of 18% to 20%? Would you agree with that? Never changed. The Bitcoin market has faced far worse before seeing even more spectacular market increases. Could things possibly go down a notch? In the near future? Without a doubt. As is probably obvious, that will be bad news for XRP and other altcoins if that occurs. This is not a catastrophe, I stress. In addition, you may read Trustworthy Crypto's thoughts on the matter at this link. Why? About a month ago, he wrote an article completely ignoring it. Because of how valuable my time is, I will skip over the one from January 25th. What he stated today, though, is that the person who spotted that quote might mention those local highs again. On this page, you can find an Ethereum price chart, the price is currently attempting to surpass the previously mentioned local highs. Retesting at this level on a dead cat bounce was always fair, as I mentioned before. The inverted phase of our Bitcoin price chart is, in my view, coming to near completion. Money that is digital after 10 days of trading inside a tight consolidation zone, the market will eventually break out. Assuming the break occurs in any way, most altcoins, including ETH, would underperform and Bitcoin's volatility will rise if this range is broken. Not only that, but he was evasive when asked about XRP, so that would also apply to X. If it falls low enough, even if it's only the market fluctuating, the residents of our community will start screaming violent murder again. But that's the truth. He asserts that altcoins often outperform Bitcoin during range and consolidation times, but that Bitcoin underperforms in shorter time periods, even as Bitcoin soars to new heights. His main point is that, wait a second, Bitcoin could be on the horizon. However, in his view, that will be irrelevant. Check his coordinates. Whether it takes 3 months or 6,011 months, we will have reached a new height in the end. The fact remains, nevertheless, that many will be wailing in agony. Matthew Highlander, an expert on charts, has found evidence that Bitcoin could form bearish divergence right now. More significantly, we will not know the exact amount until Sunday night, but it is approximately $49,000. Seems like I double-checked everything. Many analysts are under my watchful eye. It would be overwhelming, space-consuming, and full of unsolicited sales pitches to incorporate every analyst's perspective in every video I make. If there isn't clearly a strong, the future is completely unpredictable at this stage. If there is even a remote possibility that Bitcoin's value might soon fall, the market will respond accordingly. There will be an event in the near future. Even more so, this paper's author is the well-known European specialist Kevin Svensson. I can get a price below $50,000 because Bitcoin is currently very popular. Okay, no problem at all. The market clearly sees $50,000 as a fair value right now, even though there hasn't been any movement. 
I don't know how this will hold up in the long run, but if this is the desired trajectory, I think it's reasonable to expect prices to fall into the $40s and then rise again. The current price is $50,770. On top of that, there's this, a motivational piece. Authors, You Survived, and What You Survived included Eyewitness Crypto of Amsterdam, who was there throughout the events. It seems like the worst is over, therefore I wanted to remember you in a kind way. I truly hope that wasn't famous last words, but I'm skeptical. Hopefully, we're probably beyond the worst of it now. We are glad to see that XRP has achieved the desired degree of regulatory clarity, I have the ideal plan to keep the stock market going up. Madison will also momentarily shake up the Bitcoin sector, for what may or may not transpire to occur. My greatest cryptocurrency asset, XRP, has my most bullish sentiment as a result. We succeeded, in his opinion. From my point of view, this is a valid point. The price of Bitcoin fell from $68,000 to $15,000 due to a number of incidents, including Nance vs SEC, FTX's collapse, the lunar crash, three explosions at the AC3 US capital, and 700 days of fall and chop. Maybe this fan is just what you're looking for. Similar to SECV, Ripple, there are many other examples. The events of 2022 in particular were so massive that even those disasters couldn't account for everything. You can see that the altcoin market is currently substantially lower than its all-time high from 2021 on the left side of the screen. He is making his case by referencing this. The left half of the graph displays the price increases from 2017 and 2018. You may observe the 2021 altcoin market over on the right. Despite first impressions, the cash budget for 2021 was significantly larger. We are looking forward to this type of future. I suppose what I'm trying to say is that no one knows for sure, but I always admit that. Regardless, let's assess the current situation. There is yet more to come. So, I will only say that the market has reversed its gains recently. I do not mean to make anyone afraid. I only want you to know that the truth must be acknowledged. However, being an investor in cryptocurrency at the moment is an exciting experience. And XRP is mentioned in this piece by a chart analyst who dives into cryptocurrencies. The analyst notes that XRP functions on an inverted basis daily, moving average of 21 days for head and shoulders what he said earlier today is here, and we will keep you posted on any new information regarding XRP. That, together with inverse head and shoulders, is his most current update, presuming all is as it appears. In my opinion, that is a very bullish indicator. For that reason, we would like to view it. Additionally, I felt compelled to bring this out. I find this quite interesting. Today, everyone was talking about you. The purchase of enormous bitcoins has baffled many. It is not necessary for me to read the article. I was compelled to highlight that this Invest Answers thread cited X, a highly regarded chart analyst on that platform. With 26,200 Bitcoin and 1.3 billion Bitcoin, he signed a $51,000 worth of cryptocurrency. It appears to be a bullish case, maybe wealthy individuals like Zuck or Jeff Bezos are engaged. I want to be clear, this is not a wallet for exchange-traded funds. If that's the case, I'm completely confused. As soon as I have additional information, I will gladly provide an update. However, this fascinated me, as it did, for many crypto media outlets. We included it since it's unusual and has gained a lot of attention online. It is captivating to see someone who is absolutely certain. Also, you're less likely to be a complete dweeb when buying clothes when you have a ton of money. It follows that whoever did this is utterly certain that Bitcoin's value will continue to rise. When that happens, XRP and a plethora of other altcoins will support the driver. We are going to have an absolutely incredible time if that actually happens. So, we'll all find out in the end, but I feel compelled to share my incredibly hopeful outlook. My job description does not include it. Do not let anything I say influence your decision to purchase or sell. At that point, the film abruptly ends. Please support me by subscribing to my channel. Goodbye for the moment.